hello guys welcome to my youtube channel this is part two of how to make full heart for the beginners preparing the bream after you have finished with the drying of the cinnamon you have bl blocked the cinnamon and it has dried then you remove the pin from it the last uh, tutorial i taught you about how to mold at the, the your cinnamon so after removing the brim you remove the excess cinnamon from the 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 brim so that you can be able to remove take out the real uh, brim you cut it round and then make sure that it's neat and then remove that is my block brim block after that you have to wire it and you measure the wire i've already measured the wire the millinery wire that will cover the brim so you measure the millinery wire sorry about that that will cover the brim and i usually use a masking tape to cover it I use masking tape because it's easy for it to to cover very well without uh, hooking out or, or injuring the customer because the welfare of the customer is very important so you try and if it is if you are wearing it by yourself I'm sure you don't want uh, the, the the wire to come out and to to wound you so you have to tie it very well with the masking tape and that is what i'm doing now you roll it very well make sure that there's no edge coming out the wire is secure check if it fits in the brim sometimes it may fit and sometimes it may be bigger for this one, it's bigger than the brim, so I have to look for a way to make sure that it fits perfectly. If it is too big, it's going to destroy the shape of the, the brim. And if it is too uh, small, if it is smaller than the brim, then it will make the brim to sag. So it's better to have the perfect shape, and that is what I'm trying to achieve there. Now that it's fitting now, it's fitted, then I, I use my threaded needle to sew the wire with the cinnamon. And that's called, that's what we call wiring in the millinery. So you make sure that you do it carefully because the cutting edge of the cinnamon may be pulling out the the wire the the thread i mean so After the wiring, then you secure the edge of the thread by tying it very well, and then uh, you cut the excess. I have two strips here for the covering of my brim. The brim is uh, will be covered with this strip, and the strip is cut from the cinnamon in a diagonal way. At the later part of this video, I will show you how you can cut your strip that you want to use to cover the cinnamon or your brim. Now it's finished. I've finished the brim. Now the crown. So you take off the pins like you did for the crown, for the brim. Take off the pins on the crown. And that's the first step that you do after 
the the crown that you mold has dried you know the you used water to hot water for the molding of the crown in the first video now you have allowed it to dry and then you remove the pins then i'm cutting the excess um cinnamon out so that i will be able to remove the crown from the mold remember that this mold is adapted mold i need a shape and i adapted this shape you may decide to iron out your mold i mean your your crown so that it can look smooth if you look at my crown it wasn't as smooth but now it is smoother so you iron it out because cinnamon reacts with heat it does well with heat so when you heat it it stays well and it comes out Here I have my strips that are cut diagonally. You fold the first part half and the second half, then you, you fold each into two. Then you do the same to the other first half, covering the second half, and then you fold it into two. That is how you make your strip. And then it's ready for sewing. One thing that you will discover is that I'm not using the wire for the crown. It is not necessary. Some people may use it, but it's not necessary. Then here is the crown and here is the brim. Now you make a cut on the brim so that you can piece the two together. This is the piecing stage. It is called the piecing stage of making hat. You try to make sure that you cut it not once, but bit by bit in order to be able to fit in. Because once you cut it in excess, the crown will not fit in and then you have spoiled the, the crown. You have spoiled the hat. So you make sure that you cut it bit by bit cut the you make the the cutting bit by bit to ensure that it fits the crown and you add your glue to the edges and press it in like i'm doing now you press it in try to press it in very well if it's if it's bigger than the crown you see that it will not be easy for the 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 brim to fit in to the crown. There will be spaces. That's why it's important that you cut it bit by bit so that there wouldn't be any gap. There is it. Then you steam it up to make sure that it is firm because cinnamon reacts to its heat very well. So when you steam it, it makes the glue and the cinnamon to to be uh, to attach and it will not remove then i'm adding the ribbon the ribbon is just to cover all the the nitty gritties inside and then also to make it neat the purpose of the ribbon also could be that to to prevent it from harming or uh, wounding the person that is going to wear it you know the edges of the cinnamon they are always sharp so in order to not to allow it to scratch the the head of the one who is wearing the hat so you use your hand to press it in in order to make it sure that it is secure steam it and press it press it press it and that is it
Now the preparation of the trimmings. So I cut some of the cinnamon for the base of the trimming to serve as where the trimmings will rest upon. And then you use your hot glue gun to make a glue on it. And then I stick it. The trimmings can be in a different form. You can decide to use uh, artificial flowers. You can decide to use uh, handmade flower with cinnamon. It can be fabric flowers. Here I'm just using one of the artificial uh, items that I have for the uh, trimming. Try and make it and secure it very well. When you are adding the glue, using the glue gun, you must make sure that you make it neat. Neatness is very important. Then I'm going to add it, I'm going to attach it rather to the heart. Mm, that's what I want to achieve and that is it then the last thing that I will put is a rose a handmade rose I use cinnamon to make the rose as well so and that's going to be the last thing I'm going to attach and that is our finished product and thank you for watching please like share subscribe and give us your feedback thank you